Asking the question of what it means to be Jewish really uh, opens up a, a broad vista of many different things that one could use to describe the importance of being Jewish and why we value being Jewish. At the top of the list I would put continuity. It's important to me, this continuum of Jewish history that Jews have been on this earth for thousands of years and uh, notwithstanding persecutions and pogroms, uh, difficulties of all kinds, uh, dispersal into so many different lands, the fact that we not only have uh, continued our existence as a people, but as an identifiable people, and as a, a people that uh, continues to make contributions notwithstanding our small numbers in so many different fields. And when it comes to contributions, one has to look simply uh, at the beginning, going back to Moses, Moses the lawgiver, uh, the idea of the Ten Commandments, the idea of, of, of values imparted at that time, thousands of years ago, values that we uh, cherish today and that uh, are the basis uh, for democratic societies uh, all over the world. Uh, the importance really from the get-go uh, of how we framed, you could call it governance, you could call it uh, how we framed social justice, um, all of the important um, structures uh, that uh, really guide us in our lives today came from, from that very beginning. And then as you go down through history, in terms of, of science and medicine and technology and education, um, in so many different fields, law and justice, we could go on and on and on, notwithstanding our small numbers. There's something very special about being part of a... Uh, a community that has contributed so much to not only to our own people, to our own well-being, uh, but to civilization uh, in general. And that hasn't stopped. That has continued throughout, again, notwithstanding the terrible setbacks, terrible setbacks and tragedies that we've had to uh, endure. And then there's faith. There's the religion itself. Um, all of the principles, all of the, the moral um, uh, measures uh, that uh, we judge ourselves by and that we aspire to live by. Um, the Jewish religion, the first of the monotheistic faiths, um, has provided us really with the rules to live by uh, and uh, a way of looking at the world and looking at our fellow uh, citizens and fellow human beings uh, in a way um, that uh, gives us hope, gives us faith, gives us optimism, and in times of great difficulty, in times of tragedy, uh, those moments uh, we also find, or especially find, something very special in our faith, uh, which has uh, given us uh, so many important um, uh, uh, books and so many uh, important uh, guidelines, whether it be from the Sefer Torah itself, from the Torah, from the Ten Commandments, all the way down through all of the the commentaries um, on, on the Bible, uh, so much uh, there uh, to help guide us uh, in leading our lives uh, every day. Finally, it's the state of Israel. Um, the fact that uh, Jews were a sovereign people thousands of years ago, and then uh, 2,000 years uh, where we were denied our own special place, uh, where we uh, were in dispersal, we in the diaspora, uh, and then to come back, as we did in the late 1890s, uh, with the Zionist movement as led by Theodore Herzl, and there were some predecessors before, but Herzl really put it all together. Uh, and then from there to uh, 1948, uh, with the reestablishment of the modern state of Israel, such a, uh, a momentous occasion for the Jewish people. And then since 1948, uh, to have, to, to live at a time, to be blessed to live at a time, when a sovereign Jewish state uh, is, uh, is in existence uh, and is in its own way, uh, not only as the Jewish people before uh, giving all of these contributions to civilization, but Israel itself as the Jewish state making so many contributions in all of these fields that we've talked about is, uh, is something which is uh, extremely inspiring, inspiring as a Jew. And that continues uh, to the present day. Uh, which one of us uh, doesn't pay attention every day uh, to what happens in Israel. It lives in a difficult neighborhood, proud of, of um, its uh, strong ability to, to defend itself, um, 
under very difficult circumstances in a very difficult neighborhood that seems to get difficult more uh, uh, more often and seems to be difficult uh, as each day passes and yet and yet uh, despite that uh, how Israelis go about their lives and again make so many contributions to the betterment of the world in, in which we live. So for all of these reasons, the continuum of history, contributions to civilization, our Jewish faith, and the state of Israel, for all of these reasons, we're proud to call ourselves Jews and proud uh, to say that we are part of this enduring people.